we know that there is a uh, vast network of uh, Hamas integrating itself through uh, civilian infrastructure, yeah. co-locating itself with key civilian infrastructure, using Palestinian civilians as human shields by doing so, by co-locating itself in such ways. Okay, I just want to remind you that this term was actually invented by Mahatma Gandhi when he was fighting the British, but I'm not going to go into the history and so on. But also I want to remind you that, in fact, in the Israeli-Palestinian context, from this podium and other podiums often accuse that Hamas is using people as a human shields and so on. They were saying that in the Shifa hospital there was a, a photograph or surveillance of a manhole and turned out to be just for water. Let me ask you something. Do you have a definition to what is a human shield? Said, uh, it is important uh, here when we sit, talk about this, we don't, uh, this isn't, and you've heard me say this before this week, this is not hyperbole. Uh, it is fact. Hamas is a uh, designated terrorist organization. It's been a designated terrorist organization since 1997 and has been so over the course of multiple administrations of varying political parties. Uh, and we know that there is a uh, vast network of uh, Hamas integrating itself through uh, civilian infrastructure, yeah. co-locating itself with key civilian infrastructure, using Palestinian civilians as human shields by doing so, by co-locating itself in such ways. Okay, I just want to remind you that this term was actually invented by Mahatma Gandhi when he was fighting the British, but I'm not going to go into the history and so on. But also I want to remind you that in fact in the Israeli-Palestinian context, it was the Israelis who introduced the term and the activity. They would bring in the kids tie them to the jeeps and so on. There are plenty of pictures that I can send you and share with everybody here to disallow or to prevent the other kids from throwing stones at them. Sight is. The it, it, let's, let's not lose sight context. of the fact. Let's not lose sight okay. of the fact that Hamas right. has brought right. this war to Gaza, right. and they are right. a terrorist organization that uh, is is hijacking the political right. future of but, the Palestinian people. Yeah, you know, you know, uh, just my last point. Uh, you know, the Israeli Defense Ministry is really located in a densely populated area. So if the situation was reversed and somebody somehow struck a, a rocket onto that thing and, and civilians were killed, would you call that a human shield? Would you call that the Israeli defense Said, ministry? In any circumstance, in any circumstance, in, uh, in countries around the world, we have been incredibly clear about the moral imperative to ensure that steps are taken so that uh, civilian casualties and impacts on civilians are minimized. Mm -hmm.